Okay, so here we are. I'm gonna show how to drive a hybrid basically. Well, nothing special, it's just like a regular car, like I said. You don't have to do nothing else to it. The same thing what you would do to a regular car. Just sit in and start driving. You put it in drive, just like regular. And here you're gonna be able to notice as you can hear the engines on, it shows the RPM. When it goes in EV mode, it'll go in the green area. There you go, it just turned off, we are in EV mode. And uh, I'm gonna reset it to zero. And there you go, we're gonna start driving. This is how it works. We can drive, no problem. Every time you turn it on, it starts the engine for a little bit, half a minute or a minute, and then it turns off. If you doesn't need to use the power. See now we're going uphill, so I'm giving it a little gas. It turns on by itself. Now I'm taking tor taking a turn. Took my foot off the accelerator. Right away it turned it off. And now I'm driving on flatland again. I'm not accelerating too much, so it keeps it in EV. Now we're gonna turn, we're gonna go uphill again. I'm pretty sure it's gonna turn on, see, automatically does its thing, turns on. We're gonna come to the stop sign. Right away, it turned off. I'm gonna start. Turns off, turns on. And on demand. As, as soon as it feels that you take your foot off the gas, and right away, it turns off. We're in residential street, so we can't go fast here. On the Ford Escape, as long as uh, you're under 40 miles per hour, it will always turn on and off, on and off. off. Above 40 miles per hour, it will never turn off. It's something with the engineering of the car, the, some kind of things in the engine can't turn fast enough if they are going more than 40 miles an hour, so they ha it has to be on. But in city driving, it's perfect. And now I'm driving downhill major road we're gonna go all the way up to 40 speed limit is 40 here so it's perfect I will be driving I will be going downhill for quite some time over here so we can drive on EV mode for a long time you can go for and I think the maximum that I tested it will go like five miles downhill without turning on the engine and after that it will turn it on till it recharges a little bit and then turns it off again. We are at a stop right now. up to speed again now it's the engines on when you need the power it brings the engine on and as soon as I take my foot off the gas it turns it off and this car I had it for quite a long time I had it since 2009 it has under 40,000 miles on it nothing really ever went wrong with it the only thing that was wrong with it is the rear, rear tailgate <laughs> it stopped opening. I even posted a video on YouTube there where you can see how I repaired it. But other than then, that, the electric system, the hybrid system, not a single complaint so far. And it's been, as you can tell, 140,000 miles. So it's not a new car by any means. 
so as you can see right now I'm driving in city mode we are in city not city mode we are driving in the city stop lights stop signs constant stop and go stop and go as you can tell the engine is odd quite a lot engine is off quite a lot now we're gonna we have a green light so I can accelerate again Pretty much all hybrids work on this basis. I have another car, the Toyota Prius. Even though it's a lot more economical <laughs> than this car, because it's an SUV, that's a small car. That makes 50 mpgs. This one makes like 32, 34, depending on how you're driving. This uh, this one turns on and off the engine on a lot more faster. Like as soon as I take my foot off the gas, it turns off immediately. As you can see right now we are going over 40 miles an hour. It doesn't turn off the engine even if I take my foot off the gas. It just takes the RPM to the uh, lowest and that's it. And now we're coming to a stop. While it turns. Now we're gonna come to a stop over here. And let's turn it off again. But it turned green so we can keep cruising. And now we're gonna get on the highway. And now the RPM will be, the engine will be on all the time. On the highway it never turns on though never turns off the engine it's always on it uses the electric battery for steering and all kinds of other stuff for radio and uh, maybe for some of the AC as I heard I'm not sure what else but it uses tries to help you with the MPG by helping you use electricity for other stuff would be pretty much it from now on we're gonna be driving on the highway for quite some time so there's not gonna be anything interesting left to see it's pretty much the same thing over and over so I guess that would be it thank you for watching